Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Once you have created your tables, you may need to modify their structures at a later point in time. You should make these types of structural changes within the table's design view. Note that another way to open a table in design view is to simply select the name of the table into which you want to insert a new field within the navigation pane, then hold down the control key on your keyboard, then press the enter key once on your keyboard to open the selected table in design view, and then release the control key. In the table design view, you can click the row selector of the field before which you want to insert the new field. For example, if you wanted to insert a new field for hire date into a table and wanted it to be placed before the start date field, you would click the gray row selector of the start date field. Next, click the insert rows button that appears in the tools button group on the design tab of the table tools contextual tab in the ribbon. A new blank row will then be inserted above the selected row. This is your new field. You simply need to enter a name for the field and then select a data type to finish creating the new field. Then you need to save the structural modifications that you have made. Simply click the Save button in the Quick Access Toolbar to save the structural modifications that you have made. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.